Hi, it's a chilly fall day here in central Ohio, and I'm going to show you this four-bedroom, three-and-a-half bath, one-owner home uh, that has an in-ground pool. Hi, a mail is being delivered today. How's your day? Yes, sir. Well, I will. Thank you. Anyway, this has a three-car attached garage. It's stone and stucco and wood. This was built by C.V. Perry in 1997, who is a very highly regarded custom builder. Uh, probably all the way from the 40s all the way through. So we're going to go inside. This is a long video. So grab your favorite beverage and some popcorn. And we're going to go in here. Nice landscaping. And I'll try not to fall up the steps. So uh, we have an entry for you here. We're just going to kind of go through the, the house circularly. Uh, this on the floor plan says it could be a living room or a den. To me, it's it's an office. It's a home office. Um, carpet's all been clean. Nice woodwork. Nice six panel doors throughout. Uh, molding. Just a lot of high quality features. C.V. Perry was a high quality custom builder. So we have a formal dining room here. So you can entertain your fan friends and family here for Thanksgiving or the holidays. And then this leads into a huge eat-in kitchen with the center island. Um, this is the Daventry model by C.V. Perry. And this kitchen has a morning room, eating space in the rear. It's equipped with appliances, dishwasher, refrigerator, microwave. Excuse me, there's not a microwave here, but there is a bread box. How many houses do you see has got a bread box here? You can hide your stuff there. A double oven, and you can walk right into the first floor laundry. The washer and dryer stay, and there's a sink, and there's cabinetry here, uh, and access to the garage, and there's a place to put your uh, laundry items right in here. So this kitchen is kind of like the focal part of the house, in my opinion. You're walking back through here. And get a big area to put a table, and then you go an access right out here to an in-ground pool. Now the pool's been winterized. You should still have it inspected if you're going to buy this home. There's a brick patio that goes around. You got a pool here, fenced yard, fenced-in pool. A lot of privacy to the rear. Those homes were built in the 40s and 50s on Fishing the Road when this was out in the country. Uh, you have access right here to your garage in the rear, so that's nice to have. Nice landscaping here. And you're going to see when we look at the owner's bedroom first floor, there's another access outside. But uh, summer fun out here. You can walk right in and get your favorite beverage. So now we're coming in, and this is a great room or living room or family room, whatever you want to call it. It's got a gas log fireplace that does function. And look at this, nice high ceilings heading up to a loft area to the upper unit. This is almost 3,000 square feet. Now we're going to kind of roll back around here. Uh, we've got a small half bath, so your guests can go right in here and use the restroom. And then you have your owner's bedroom here. First floor owner's bedroom. Again, access to the outside, to the pool area. So, hey, get up at 6 a.m. in the summer and jump on out and head in the pool. Get your diving board. Get your laps in. Then uh, back here we've got uh, the main bath. Got one of the definitely 90s vintage tubs, which probably hasn't been used since Bush has been president. Double sinks, commode area, small walk-in closet, and a shower. Note we have here, I would imagine this was custom made, the beautiful stained glass window. So you can sit in this soaking tub, soak away, look out that window, and uh, imagine yourself seeing those birds somewhere. Ceiling fans in nearly every room. 
So uh, we're going to go upstairs. What I like about this upstairs is there a loft area. So you've got children up here. This could be a nice little study area. And it could be great for the kids to just sit there and throw stuff down and get into a fight. Uh, so you can put a little study nook here. And then I kind of call this the second owner's bedroom. It's not as large, but it has a walk-in and it has its own full bath. So again, this house has three and a half baths and four bedrooms. Uh, we got a couple other bedrooms down here and a full bath. Again, with ceiling fans. Maybe I can get this turned on. Hey, it works. Full bath. And then another bedroom here. Now, if you even needed more space, this has a full basement, and it's high. So you could even bring basketball players down there. You could finish that basement out if you needed some extra living space. Let's go down and take a look. Hi. Hi, are you Joe? I'm Joe. I'm Denise. I'm Heather X's sister. Hi. You go look around. Terrific. I'm shooting a video. And I'll keep no, you just you just you. do what you want to do, unless you want to be in the video, Denise. Okay. So we've had a lot of initial activity on this house. We already had one showing. We had on the Northwest Realtors tour, and now Denise and her sister Heather had saw this and are interested, and so Denise is doing a walkthrough. I got about seven showings scheduled today. This is really good construction. It's not. Two by sixes. It's two by eight, uh, about 12 inches or 16 inches on center. It's about a 13 course block wall. So, I mean, it's really it's quite, four joists going across. It's probably eight, eight and a half high. Furnace and AC updated. There's a laundry area down here. So, if you got a, if you need, to do a lot of laundry, you could probably throw another washer and dryer down here. Uh, but this is just, you know, begging to be finished. Um, there's a radon system installed. That does not mean there's not radon here, because this was installed over 30 years ago. But that's a good short chance, and you could probably have the company who did it come back and do a reassessment on that. Uh, panel box, we got some in stuff to do with the pools. And the owners have left some of the pool items here as far as servicing the pool. Because you buy a pool, you got a job. But this is kind of it here. So um, sump pump in the corner. So we'll end up down here again. 3389 Stone Vista, Hilliard Schools, City of Columbus, taxes, water, sewer, just west of Upper Arlington, close access to the Mill Run area and to the Upper Arlington shopping area. This home will be open this coming Sunday. I think it's the 20th of October, 1 to 3. But we can show it by an appointment. Give me a call or text. I'm Joe Jackson with Keller Williams Capital Partners Realty, 614-271-4263. Thanks for watching. You have a super fantastic day.